What's going on Wix Nation? MPS here from Wix Training Academy and today I will be showing you how to create automation emails on your Wix website. I've been receiving this question a lot lately and it's time to clear it up. This goes for if you have freebies, if you want to send welcome emails, thank you emails, any of these forms of emails can all be easily solved and sent using Wix.com. Now, I know that you're sitting here wondering, Michael, why are you wearing a suit? And the answer to that is actually, and I want to preface this by saying that absolutely nothing is changing here on Wix Training Academy, but my father and I are actually launching a sales training business. And so I will be in a suit for the next 90 days working personalized with a particular client, excuse me, and working through their sales systems to kind of get the basic premise of our foundational system off the ground, launched, and proven. So that's why I'm in a suit, and you'll see me in this exact setting for at least the next 90 days. Uh, if you guys are brand new to the channel, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you smash that subscribe button and turn those bell notifications on so you don't miss any content here on the channel and you'll instantly plug into the largest Wix training community on the internet. And as much as I know you wanna see this pretty face for a whole lot of time today, I'm not here to deliver you a whole lot of time, I'm here to show you how to get these automations done here on Wix, and that's gonna be a quick video. So let's jump into the content. Okay, guys, so you're sitting here in your Wix dashboard. Um, now, again, I'm going to say this again. These automations are for a variety of different types of emails to happen. So, for instance, if you have a member register to your website and you want to send them a welcome email, that can happen. If you have someone purchase from your online store, you want to send them a thank you email, that can happen. Instantly, immediately, you could choose the time delay. We'll go through all that. So I'm going to show you how to make it happen. So you're here in your Wix dashboard. What you're going to do is you're going to see Ascend by Wix and you're going to see Customer Management. You're going to hover over that and then you'll see this other sidebar pop up and you'll see Automations. You're going to click Automations. When you get to Automations, you will see that Wix gives you the ability to create some automations. But I want to just give you some uh, examples. Build customer relationships. Send a thank you email to anyone that submits a form on your website. Email visitors who submit a form and create a task to follow up. Yeah, you can create task management systems here in Wix now too. Wix is really evolving with their CRM, which is beautiful. You can label contacts when they send a chat message, so that way uh, internally they're labeled. Engage with your members. You can invite people to come back to your website if they've been off for a while and inactive. You can thank new members with a uh, follow-up email. You can send a welcome email. And then there's a bunch of different things. Maybe you've got uh, customers currently in your Wix dashboard and they're on an invoicing system or on payment plans. You can notify customers that a quote expires. You can remind them that an invoice is due. Um, you could do all of these different automations, which is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. You would press create first automation and or use one of the pre-made ones that already exist. Uh, and then you choose your trigger. Your trigger is when one of these things, and right now the automations work for all of these particular Wix apps and Wix functions. So Wix forms, price quotes, invoices, workflows, members area, spaces, inbox, and contact form. So whenever an action is taken on one of these types of apps through Wix, it triggers a response and so we'll just say for this one members area okay so select a trigger for this app when a member signs up to our website so when a member signs up to our website and that's the trigger I want this to happen so if this then this if then statements if a visitor signs up to your site then this is the action do this and you would choose which of these actions you want to have happen do you want to send a welcome email to contacts? Do you want to get notified? You. Do you want to be notified that someone signed up? Do you want it to create a task in your uh, system? Do you want it to move a card in your workflow um, through your project management? Do you want to connect a webhook? Do you want to connect to Zapier? And if you don't know what Zapier is, Zapier allows multiple apps, literally every app you can imagine, software, 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 connect and talk to one another. 
incredible tool Zapier is. Do you want to add label to a contact? Do you want to assign a badge to that particular member? And then you can choose what these actions look like. Now, here's the beautiful thing. You're not limited to just one. So if you want, you can use this trigger and then have it create multiple actions. You just need to make sure you create an automation for each of those particular functions you want to be carried out. So once you use visitor signs up to your site, it's not like you can just use that one and then that trigger is only associated with one. You would choose that and then you would choose your action. So you can literally come through here, choose one, and then go back and make another and say, okay, but I also want to be notified by email. Okay, but I also want a task created when this person's done registering. And then what you'll do is you'll see, um, in this case, I chose send an email to contacts. You can choose your sender details here. Um, you would choose your from name and your reply to email. And obviously, you're going to do that with whatever your name is and whatever your email is. And then if you came in here, you actually have the ability to uh, edit this email as well. So if you press edit template, it would take you to Wix shout out and you can edit the details. You have to uh, edit your sender details and get them approved through Wix first because they have to ensure that it's legitimate. Once that's approved, which it's instant, as long as you put in the proper stuff, you just got to confirm. You'll be good to change this, but you would just edit template just like you would normally send an email with Wix shout out in any marketing campaigns or anything like that. You have the same ability to edit those emails and come through the email editor, and then you could even preview and test the email as well. So you could come in here and check, okay, I want to make sure my email looks good before it gets sent out 19,000 times. 20,000 in the case of which training academy and then you could come in here test it out you could click buttons blah 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 and then it would take you to your site and you like I said edit that email now we're gonna go ahead and go back and so that's what we chose to do with the welcome email and then lastly you have timing so how do you want this timing to work do you want it sent out immediately after that person registered to your website or do you want to set a custom time? Do you want it a day after? Do you want it hours after? How long after? And then do you want it uh, a certain frequency? Do you want it to trigger every single time or once per contact or once per every 24 hours? And obviously the frequency will vary depending on what your function is that you're carrying it out and what trigger is causing it to happen. And then you choose these things and you literally customize your automation and then you could even add a follow-up action. You could say, okay, I want to choose a follow-up action. So um, after that happens, I also want to blah, blah, blah. I want to get notified by email or I want to assign a badge to a member. You would come add a badge and then you can choose. Do you want to wait between actions or have it respond immediately? Um, and then you could choose how long after. And you can literally keep coming in here and adding follow-up action, follow-up action, follow-up action. And then what you're going to end up doing is you are just going to name whatever your action is. So we'll just say welcome email. And then you're going to press activate. And it's going to activate your automation. So basically any basic functions you want automated on your website, such, such as sending emails, creating tasks, assigning badges, um, creating follow-ups for you, workflows, stuff like that, can all be managed by automations. So that way you never have to click any additional buttons go through any manual work it's just done for you through Wix's automation system it's extremely powerful uh, and it takes a huge load of work off you so I hope you enjoyed today's video again I know you didn't get to see this pretty face here too long but I hope you enjoyed the time that you did get to see me and I hope the content was valuable to you if it was make sure you drop a like down below don't forget to comment comments help the video they help the channel and it helps me know what you liked about this video and or what other content you would like to see on the channel so please comment and lastly don't forget to make sure to smash that subscribe button and turn those bell notifications on and you'll instantly plug into the largest Wix training community on the internet. Guys, we got to the point where we're wearing suits. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This is for something completely separate. You guys know how casual I am over on Wix Training Academy. But uh, I'd appreciate it if you would click that subscribe button. And also, if you want free Wix training as well as some paid courses, you can head over to WixTrainingAcademy.com. Click Join the Academy. Joining the Academy is absolutely free, and you get a bunch of free resources. Like I said, there are some paid ones over there as well. But uh, you've got access to a bunch of free resources either way if you just go join the Academy over at WixTrainingAcademy.com. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I look forward to catching you 
on our next one.